Okay. Welcome aboard Fish Flight 123. Please keep your eyes the mouse at all times. <laughs> and no oh, this is so cool. I'm taking a little ride seat, in a fishy's mouth. This is what VR that is all about. <laughs> Welcome to the Oasis. My name is Mike and today I'm going to be checking out Fisherman's Tale on the Oculus Rift. Now I first got my hands on this game a few months ago at Gamescom in Cologne and I was impressed with the initial demo that I had. Now I've been looking forward to checking out the game ever since because as you'll know if you follow the channel puzzle games are really my bag in virtual reality. Thankfully the developers have given me early access to the first two chapters of the game of which there's five in total. So in today's gameplay I'll just be showing you the first two chapters and my playthrough of that. So the game is due for a release in January 2019 and will be available for HTC Vive, Oculus Rift, PSVR and Windows Mixed Reality users. So I hope you guys and girls enjoy this sneak peek of Fisherman's Tale on the Oculus Rift and without further ado, let's dive in. Okay, welcome to Fisherman's Tale. As you can see we're in this beautiful environment of the Fisherman's sort of house in the lighthouse. And I just want to show you something. This is what makes this game super crazy. So if we look outside the window here, <laughs> there is another fisherman looking out a window, and that's me. I'm controlling it. And then it gets even crazier when I look over here and move a bit closer. There is another fisherman in here that I'm controlling. So there's a huge fisherman there. Whoa. <laughs> and there's a little tiny fisherman here. And I'm controlling them both, of course, and controlling myself, who's in the middle. So this is the kind of puzzle mechanic of this game. You've kind of got to manipulate the environments and using scale as part of the puzzle design. And I'll show you exactly what I mean now. So this anchor, for example, here that you can see in my room is blocking the door. It was time to raise this anchor. <laughs> exactly. He's telling us exactly what to do. And we need to pick it up and get it out of here. So... Of course. Here we go. As below, so above. <laughs> when he lifted Look at the that. tiny anchor, the large one was lifted by his giant self. <laughs> it's so cool. So that's out of the way now. And now maybe we can go and open the door to find out what else we need to do. So let's go and see if we can do that now. Zut. The door was locked. Hmm. He must have put the key somewhere last time he left this room. The key. Now, when was that? The key. And then, my friends, the strangest thing happened. Okay. Inside this room where he knew every cranny and nook. Looks so cool. An unfamiliar voice said, Hey, oh. hey you. Yes, you, the scruffy looking puppet. Ah, hey. Yeah. <laughs> you, Mr. Over here. Hey. Hey, little buddy. In the cockle? If you can find me my hat, I will be the captain, of course. And the captain needs his hat and a life preserver, just in case. A hat and, uh, and a life preserver. Ones, we will be brave. Okay. Well, of course, courageous Captain Crab, huh. said the fish. Wait. Your hat and a life preserver. That's a life preserver. No. Where would an everyday wooden puppet find a tiny hmm. life preserver and a hat fit for a crab? Well, I'm sure we can find one in here, maybe, because the huge one, of course, is on the wall just there. But if we dive into the little puppet's house, there. then we can take this one. <laughs> you got it. Feel the storm coming. There you go, little buddy. I feel more buoyant already. Great. Now I just need a hat. Yes, we need a hat for you. People know I'm in charge. Hmm? Kind of reminds me of Sebastian from uh, The Little Mermaid. You know? Cheeky little crab. Um, oh, wait. So there's an anchor in that, that door. So let's use this. But this storm is really, really. There might be some. Ha 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 ha! Yes. The handle was missing. Was there another hat okay. somewhere? So we've got the hat, but to make it smaller, we need to. Ah, maybe I can take the hat off this guy. Dip in. Push. Buy hat. 
It's so cool. Bring it to me when you find something. Yes, I've got it. Calm down. So, you found everything? Cool your jets. Well, if a little wooden puppet like you can do this, then uh, I will be uh, brave. Thank you very much. Now I just need the key, now, please. Just let me get out of this. Kiki, come on. Damn. Shell. Ah. Oh. <coughs> Wait. It's a teeny you, tiny you. key. Really? <laughs> I feel so much lighter. Yeah, and nice one. Feels so much Cheers, mate. Bigger. Um I think I can go back into my shell after this. Maybe. Right, let's do this. I'll help you open the door. <laughs> He's just chatting away. If we put this in here. There we go. The key. That will do. All right. Perfect. Are you ready? Me too, I think. Let's go. Go to the next room. See what happens next. I won't forget what you did for me. Adieu. Danny Crab. You wouldn't need to find his way up the tower in the darkness. Okay, so now we've got access to this new area of the lighthouse. A load of pipes over there. I'm sure it's going to be a puzzle later on. The biggest and... fish Papa oh. ever caught. The fisherman had spent all his <laughs> life trying to learn to catch. It's okay, little fish. That. Well, don't you look like a dumb thing of... <coughs> water. <laughs> I love all the voice acting in this. It's awesome. It was still alive. This went against everything he had learned. He had to get the fish some water. Get the fish some water. Hmm. Get the fish some water. No. Um. Can we use this? Nope. Huh. Get the fish some water. What are these? Oh. Something just moved. Okay. Let's go and figure out what that was then. Ah, of course. The front of the lighthouse. <laughs> what is this? Oh my god. Throw that over there. Look at that. And there's the little fishy. And there's me. You can just make out me in the background bending over. That's so cool. This teeny tiny bucket. Ah, oh, I love the way they use scale in this game. It's so impressive. Okay, so let's try and get some water for you the fish. Find some water for the poor creature. No. Nope. Uh, maybe we can get some from the tap. Chum buckets. No water in the tap. Chum buckets. No water. Ah, so of course that's where the pipes come in. So we need to repair these pipes. And oh, there was one in the the chest, of course. So let's put that in there. And uh, I think there was a teeny tiny one. Yes, a teeny tiny one on this shelf. <laughs> well, that's not going to work. So we're going to have to put that through uh, the lighthouse over here to make it bigger. OK, so maybe if we pop it down here. Ah, perfect. And we need one more. One more pipe. It's alright, little fish. I'll get you some water, water. soon. Water. Okay. Water, water, water. Pipe, pipe. Where is the pipe? Mm. Ah, of course. There's a, there's a pipe there, watch. <laughs> <laughs> that is so cool. Okay, so we've got the last pipe. Then we can give the fish some water. There. Now the water. Yes! Okay. Maybe this will work now? Success. Ooh! Too much, too much oh no! Success. Water flooded into ah! Another. It's flooding! Quick, hold your <gasps> breath! <gasps> The water closed over him, and the memories came flooding back. The coldness, the oh. darkness, 
the ocean tossing and turning him like a like a rag doll. Ooh. That fisherman's Wait a minute. clearly seen some stuff. <laughs> no, a bit of water wouldn't stop this fisherman. <laughs> it's neat physics. Okay, so the fish should be super happy now because there's a lot of water. Here we go. <laughs> I'm hungry. Hungry. <laughs> Whoa. Hmm. It seemed Papa had forgotten food. to feel his stuffed Is fish. There food out here? There must hmm. be food. Food. Food for Who the are you? fish. Oh, noble fish. And do you know how to reach the top of the lighthouse? The fisherman asked. I'm a big eyed tuna. My eyes are <laughs> bigger than my stomach. And if you want to go upstairs, my little amusebouche, well, you'll have to feed me first. <laughs> I'm in a little amusebouche, apparently. Um, Nothing. He kind of looks like Dory from uh, Finding Nemo. I shall to what about these uh, you sardines? Ah, oh, this might work. Here we go. That smelled. Mm. Here you go. Vintage. You ready? But a stuffed fish could hardly be uh. picky. <laughs> Good. Yes. Good. Yes. But I need more. More? Bigger. Bigger. <laughs> These are just appetizers. I oh. Want the main course. So maybe if we scale it up. How do we scale it up? Oh yeah, we can put the fish in here. And then we've got a super big fish. Yes! <laughs> We're like putting him under my arm. Let's go. Let's go. Oh! Wait! I can see the little fish there. <laughs> okay, let's feed him this big fish. This should make him happy. And hopefully we can get to the next part of the lighthouse. Here you go, dude! Uh, wait! Uh. Uh, on that. Nice one. A bone? A bone? A fish bone. <laughs> You're choking it's on the fish bone. Uh oh. What next? It seemed the fish had choked on its own appetite. Oh. And also a fish bone. Oh. He had to climb inside the ah. Oh, okay, okay, the okay. Yeah, of course. Afraid. How Ooh. many of this fish's family? Shiny teeth you have. In search of the biggest catch. Okay. How do I know you won't eat me? Yeah, quite. The fisherman asked. Well, oceans are near. <laughs> so I mean, you're made of wood <laughs> and probably lead-based paint. Lead-based paint. <laughs> and now it was paying the price. But okay. The well, knew what that felt like. Yeah, I have yeah, to trust him. Well. Okay, let's go. Oh. Uh, no, there was the I'm getting out. Attention. Better? <sighs> Thank you, fisherman. I, You're welcome. I could not get enough, you know. I wanted more, always, like an obsession. <laughs> you, leggy land walkers, we don't know. I'm a leggy land walker, apparently. Of course, you have everything, don't you? Well, what could the puppet say to that? Oh. Now, I must repay you. Yes, please. The key to the tower door is outside. I saw a huge figure hide it near the mirror. Near the mirror. A long time ago. Outside? I'm certain Ooh. it was around here. Ah! Uh, okay. Uh. Oh, wait. I can see something. Climb on in. <sighs> ah. Okay. So I think it's in the mirror there. I can just about see it. So, uh... Oh. Wait, he wants me to go back in his mouth? The heck? Okay. Welcome aboard, Fish Flight 123. Please keep your eyes inside the mouth at all times. <laughs> and no oh, this is so cool. I'm taking Watch a little ride seat, in a fishy's mouth. This is what VR is all about. <laughs> 
something between his eyes. And there was a distinct smell of... Oh, yes. Sardines. Okay. Here we are. Mind your step. So we need to get in. The key was too high. Oh. He needed something. Uh, perhaps back in the lighthouse, there might be something he could use. Hmm. Maybe we could stack these up. I guess we could try that. We just need to maybe stack these items up here, and then maybe we could reach the key. So. Easy does it. There we go. Let's take another ride in the fish and see if that works. Okay, so when you stack stuff, it doesn't stay there. Hmm. Ah, wait, 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 wait. There is a ladder here. Ha 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 ha. Yes. Yes! <laughs> Finally! Okay, let's go back into the fish. <laughs> Taking a ride in a fish is crazy. Oh, yes! We did it! Yes! At last. Ta da! Time to get back to the lighthouse. Oh, right. Let's go. Okay, so we've got the key to go to the next part of the lighthouse. Whatever I think next, the that is the end, unfortunately. Let's see. Anderson. Thank you for setting me free. I hope you reach the top of the tower. Cheers, tuna friend. The door opened. Thank you. The lighthouse tower waited. <laughs> the fisherman had begun to think that he had all the answers, but he would soon realize he had bitten off maybe more than he could chew. Okay guys and girls, so there we have it. That is Fisherman's Tale on the Oculus Rift. I had a great time checking out the first two chapters of this game, and there's going to be five chapters in total, so maybe around two and a half hours of gameplay in total, I would guess. But what I've played so far, I've really enjoyed. The art style is fantastic. The puzzle design with this kind of Inception style lighthouse within a lighthouse is very interesting and uh, you know it's great to sort of manipulate those objects within the sort of lighthouses between each other. Also the characters in game were really sort of funny and quirky and they were voice acted really well. And talking about the voice acting, the narration uh, in the background sort of explaining what was going on and the backstory of the fisherman was also spot on. So yeah, I'm super impressed with what I've played with uh, so far. You know, everything looks really polished and is a lot of fun to play. Just whether or not this will have the long-term replayability, probably not, but I think it'll be a short and sweet adventure that will definitely be worth checking out. So I hope you guys and girls enjoyed this little sneak peek of Fisherman's Tale on the Oculus Rift, but I'd love to know your thoughts in the comments down below. Are you excited for this one? Do you think you're going to pick this one up? If so, let me know which platform you're going to play it on. PSVR, Oculus Rift, HTC Vive or Windows MR. I'd love to know in the comments down below. Leave a like if you like the video, make sure you're subscribed for all my future content, and as always, I'll see you on the next one. Cheers.